every single last one I'm got my back. Hey, twenty of us, that's twenty goons in the ice cream whip, triple school. I got three strikes, ain't got to lose. When it's all on the line, what you gonna do? Come on, I'm highly favored. Don't wanna blame me, uh. No conversation, ain't got time for no debating. It's for the taking, no hesitation. Uh. Don't try my patience. I'ma pour out one for the set, pour it till there's nothing left. On a run to the bread until we all got them baguettes. Hear them footsteps coming, cause we coming for the check. We ain't gon' run, no, we don't hide. I can never switch, not a day in my life. Long as my dogs, they by my side. Yeah, we gon' ride till we die, die, die. With the throne, I ain't the king of the pawn. Hop on the jet across the globe. I guess the boat is my home, and there's so many milk. Cause bird in my dome, and like turbulent air, I'm switching these flows. If you look at my neck, boy, I'm letting it snow. I'm sturdy as hell, it's a vessel alone. They showing me love in my city. Gang saying hippies, women like Nicky know what I'm about. I'm not, I'm not, they're stereotypes. They do not fit me, I'm bigger than life. Gave everyone dogs. I'm not a guard, go hop with a squad. I'm playing my part, from LeBron. Bring to the team, I'm projecting it hard. The homie calling from a cell. A couple of homies be making a thing. I just want all of them dudes to do well, and I'm worried about taking the cup. Now let's take a minute to see how you can improve your team. Everybody, it's the coach. You're tuned in to Sunday Night Football on EA Sports. Up next, we'll see Jared Goff and Coach. Thanks. CA Sports coverage of the National Football League brings us to First Energy Stadium in Cleveland, Ohio. Tonight, we've got a great Sunday night matchup between the Los Angeles Rams and the Cleveland Browns. So out come the Rams now for their first possession. They're led onto the field by the former Cal Bear and the number one overall pick in 2016. Jared Goff. And frankly, this is the type of game that a great quarterback relishes because 0-2 on the road. 
everything's against him and his team. No one can expect them to win. Sometimes you band together real tight in that situation, and if he plays really well, they've got a chance to get that done. Brought down that time by Christian Kirksey. As usual, the hallmark of a good run defense, linebackers making plays near the line of scrimmage. Absolutely nowhere to run there. Delayed give, go up to Gurley. And not much to speak of. Call it a one-yard gain up to the 26. A look now at the defensive starters for Cleveland. They're going to need to be strong against the run in this one. Most of their challenges have come in the passing game because against the run, they've been pretty darn good. Now you've got to figure out a way to slow down those receivers before they get downfield and maybe make a few more plays on the ball when it's in the air. And the Browns pressure gets to him that time, and he's going to go down. The D tackle, Sheldon Richardson, came barreling in for the sack. And we say it all the time, have to be able to get rid of the ball sooner than that. You have to help your offensive line out. They're going to protect you as best they can. And if you're getting three to five seconds to throw the ball, they're doing a really nice job. But when you hold it and give up a sack, you're really almost discrediting their work. Nice job bringing that one back. 14 on the return. And the Browns will take over first and 10. Good starting field position for them as they come up first and 10. First down, Mayfield. And an alley to run. And he'll avoid the tackle there with a slide. The drive starting with a first down, 11 yards on that pickup. Partner, he was going through his progressions. Not there, not there. After about the third one, he decided he better pull it down and run for it. And he slides down and avoids the hit for good measure. Mayfield on first down. Throw left side, got to be taken in by Harris. And he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. The completion good for three, and it's second down. And a look now at the starting offense for the Browns. And the focus will definitely be on wide receiver Odell Beckham Jr. after the trade from the New York Giants to the Cleveland Browns. How will he mesh with his new quarterback, Baker Mayfield? And can they be the duo that leads Cleveland to the playoffs for the first time since 2002? And oh, he's going to be brought down by the face mask. Here come the flags. This is going to get him a first down. Well, we looked at each other right away. We knew that flag was coming out. And I always enjoy the conversation post because officials always tell you, I don't want to throw the flag, but you caused the play. You did it. I had to. And he's going to push his way down to about the 12. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven. Leaves him with a second and three. The Browns opted not to pick a running back with their first two selections at number one and four in the first round. But they circled back in the second round and got a really good one to Nick Chubb out of Georgia. Broke off a nice run there, and that's where he's good. Good vision, able to see where the hole is. And he'll score. Touchdown, Browns. Baker Mayfield, his fifth touchdown now on the year. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. An ideal start for them, really. You force the punt, and then you go down and score. And you've got to see a fist pump on the sideline from the head coach, don't you? Because he's turned into his bench, and he's telling his team, this is how we prepare. Force the punt, go downfield and score. I told you guys, it's just like a boxer in the gym preparing for the fight. Now we get turned it all loose. 